Hi guys, welcome to Off Camping. Um, today I'm going to take the canoe down to the river, uh, try and tow it on the e-bike. Got this little trailer here, well this little trolley, it's not really wide enough. The wheels aren't really rated for highway use, but if we just go slow, hopefully we'll get there, you know, a little bit quicker than walking. Let's give it a go. Hardest part is trying to get the wheels like straight under the canoe. It's on, um, just in front of the, uh, the front seat. It takes like two thirds of the weight out of it. Well, a third of the weight out of it. The more you get it in the center, the more it wants to like move the trolley, you know, doesn't sit well enough. Lift these legs. Right, now the bike. This is the Mark II version. This little pump underneath it, the bike's not carrying any weight yet. Oh yeah. This is a product placement uh, video for the Heavenway Cruiser. Sent me this uh, a couple of months ago now. But it should be good if you get on the river. I'm gonna try and put the bike in the boat and you know go down the river. If we can get there, that is. But yeah. Hopefully put my stuff at the back. Take the plant pot away. I've got some weight in the back now, so paddle, pack, life jacket. Might just go around the block and see what it feels, you know, before I hit the highway. It's quite scary. Will, will they give you points on your license for doing this? Probably should. It needs work. Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> Look at it. Twisted. Need to work on like a bigger, bigger frame. I did buy one of those like kids trolleys. You know, kids, you know, the tow along children on the back of a bike. Right. Need to get that like, adapted. And where the cruiser is capable of it. It's only in first, the first gear setting at the moment. And the bike's you know, heavy enough, just need to sort out the trolley.
uh, not what we want. <laughs> Yeah, it's not going to work. Oh. No, it's good to test these things. I'll come back for you, canoe. But the Hemingway Cruiser. Fun bike. <laughs> Billy's uh, engineering skills. Not so good, not so great. Not today, canoe. Not today, eh? Now I just fell off completely. <laughs> Back to pulling it. A bit about the bike. Um, 250 watt hub motor, uh, seven gears, Shimano gears, and uh, four levels of power assist. As soon as you pedal, it does take off, so sometimes it does surprise you. It's got a little throttle on this side, but that in the UK you're not allowed to like, um, full full power in throttle throttle mode. Uh, what's the build quality like? I've um, dropped it a couple of times. I've fallen off it on the road once. I thought it was going to be a, a bit of a mess to be honest, but it was all right. Just got back on it. I started riding it again. Sometimes uh, the quick release does get a little loose on its own. It's a little, little worrying sometimes, but just make sure you tighten it properly. It's a heavy bike, but it's got me to work it back like uh, a lot, lot easier than it would be on a normal bike. I went on a, a non-power assisted bike the other day, and my god, it was health. You know, once you go electric, hard to go back. So it's a 17.5 amp hour battery, where you can take off, you know, and take it to work to charge a couple of times, and uh, take it off to not worry about it getting nicked. So yeah, there's a the bike. Uh, now, please stay tuned for some uh, mac and cheese in a canoe. Thanks for watching, guys. Yeah, I'm gonna have a. Let's go get some mac and cheese tonight. Some bacon in it. Yes, that's it. Dinner. So, yeah. Pasta pre cooked. <coughs> Takes long enough to cook pasta at home. Never mind doing it, you know, can it? Pan. Uh, bacon, butter. Flour, cheese, milk, hot sauce. Yeah, let's get quite hungry. So yeah, I saved myself. Well, I saved myself. <laughs> I had breakfast, like you know, sausage, beans, and hash browns. Not hash browns. What are they called? Waffles, potato waffles, and toast this morning. Then. All of them for the rest of the day is four donuts, you know, saving myself for tonight. You know. Sometimes I eat too much in the day and don't want to do anything. And I'm going to be thinking about food to like take camping, but yeah, yeah. Good. Got a butter in there, all melted. We've got some flour. Got 
flower. Make our little roof. If it's getting too hot and you think you're going to burn it, just lift it up a bit. Now. Make a bit more flour as needed. Didn't measure this stuff out, but that's all the flour. Not really the best pan for a room, you need better off with like a thick bottom pan. But if you start bringing a copper pans camping, you know, I think you've got a problem. Not that it's not a good thing, you know, but... I think I bring it like a... Like a, a copper bottom pan once, we'll try to catch a bit, so yeah, take that off for a second. While we open the milk. Got a little whisk, brilliant. Have I ever bring a whisk camping? Ooh, don't think so. I'm not, I've made mayonnaise in the back of my van, but I don't really can. Boats rocking and all that. Just making a better meal. And I just now remembered I was going to cook the bacon first. Whoops. For the bake, why we're waiting for the bacon? Let's put it by the canoe. I've finally got some airbags in it one rear and one at the back. Well, yeah, that's the rear. I'm the front at the moment, facing, facing, <laughs> facing the rear, the paddle solo. Yeah, it's got ash going all so like one side is three bits of ash, like a uh, scarf jointed together, and the other one's four bits and some shorter lengths. There's still, still a lot of like need to get a plane. The canoe is not level all the way down. It's like the moulding. They just seem to like trim it off, chuck the plastic, the vinyl, you know, wherever it is. Done all on. The yoke. I had to make I'm gonna have to make a new yoke because everyone doesn't fit now. Because that was like more good good going on it. The plastic gun is for thicker, I think they came out right there. These are only going there, so yeah. yeah. It looks alright, but you know, from a distance. But it's not that comfy at the moment. The sharp edge is still needs to be rounded off. And um it makes like taking it off the car a bit more difficult. I normally just like put it on sort of uh, hit the deck. With one of the end ends, but with wooden, never get, might break that off or something. Some of the bacon is crisping, but with some of it is like crisping with um, what's it called, a bechamel crust. But yeah.
<laughs> Probably looks well strange if someone's watching me from somewhere. <laughs> this guy's shaking in a boat with his arms and waggling. Oh shit. Nearly lost it. Nearly lost it. Give this a go. Didn't bring any salt and pepper, stupidly. Um, but hopefully, it's got enough cheese and bacon. So, yeah. Yeah, I do. Oh, moving bacon. So, from uh, the River of Salisbury, um, thanks for joining me. Hope you like this little paddle, at least. I'll see you in the bushes. Uh, until next time. Thanks, guys.